What are rocks used for? Like, well, what's the point of even using these things? I don't know, Minecraft? No, rocks are actually used for some things. Let's find out what. So, coal. Coal is actually sedimentary. This means in the bottom of the lake. Uh, when you use coal, it can be burned in power plants as fuel. Um, I think it's like a fossil fuel or something. It's not a good fuel to use. Oh, that's hilarious. Fossil fuel, sedimentary. Ha <laughs> ha. Fossils. Anyway, um, coal can be used to burn in power like those old trains or whatever. Okay, that's a use. Granite is commonly used for as decorative stone in homes and offices. Looks nice on a countertop. Marble is metamorphic. Actually, I didn't know granite was in the ground. Interesting. Marble is metamorphic, so it's already been changed. Frequently used for sculpting. Limestone. <laughs> You know, I hate this one. Sedimentary. Knew that. It's used as the main ingredient in creating cement. I did not know limestone was a main ingredient in creating cement. Interesting. And now, the exciting conclusion to whether or not Mr. Clancy found a limestone in the bottom of Lake Ontario. We're going to try to um, put these different rocks... And this, whoops, she's lost a few, lost a few experiments, okay. I'm gonna put the vinegar in here this time. You have no idea how cold my tootsies are right now. Oh. Go in the water, they said. Of course, go in the water, you know. It's not like it's freezing or anything. Okay. Our best shot is definitely this one because it's got mud and stuff on it. So we'll put him in. Oh, one of the hit. And we're waiting. Doesn't look like he's gonna bubble. Come on, rock. Nothing. Ugh. Next. Just dead flies. Gross. No, not out here. No. Oh, come on, nothing? All that? Somebody. Somebody bubble or something. Ow, 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 Did I say ow yet? Ow, Translation, I'm going to use the big handful of these little flecks and sand and stuff to put them in vinegar and see if there's any limestone in these little sediments. Ow, 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 How about this? Oh, look, look, there's bubbles. That could just be air. My God, it's working! It's working! That can't all be air bubbles. There is lime somewhere in this, and it is bubbling. It's still going, too. Uh. Pumice, igneous, used as rough material in hand soaps and nail files. Ooh, use rocks for your nail files and clean. Who cleans their hands with rocks? Huh. Nice, nice. It's metamorphic, used mainly in construction as a building material. Shale, sedimentary, often used to create pots, bricks, tile roofs. Gabbro. Igneous, uses a crushed stone, used as crushed stone for a mixture in cement and gravel roads. And quartzite, which I've never heard before, I know quartz, whatever, used as a decorative stone frequently for tables and countertops. So rocks and minerals have been used for ages for different purposes. 
They are the building blocks for modern cities. Let's find out what they mean by that. Buildings and structures. If you've ever looked at the skyline of a heavily populated city, that's a skyline, uh, then and seen all the tall buildings, then you have witnessed how rocks and minerals have been used to literally build cities. Everything in the buildings comes from rocks and minerals, from the steel frame structure to the glass windows. That's all rocks. Huh. Streets and sidewalks. Modern roads are usually made from asphalt, which is a mixture of sand, gravel, and refined oils. So like your driveways and stuff are made like, like asphalt, which is sand, gravel, which is like dirt and stuff, refined oils. Sidewalks are made of concrete. You can make concrete, apparently, by combining sand, gravel, cement, and water. Kind of cool. So if you put some sand and gravel and stuff together with water, you can make yourself a sidewalk. Art and beauty. Okay, statues are chiseled from large pieces of rocks, such as marble, that are easy to form and shape and polish. In ancient times, colored minerals were ground down to a fine powder and mixed with animal fats and used as... That's disgusting. So they used, like, animal fats and rocks to make paint. Hmm, different, I guess. So other tools you can get out of your rocks... Well, they are used to make forks, spoons, knives, pots, pans, all made of metal, hammers, nails, screwdrivers, power tools, either made of metal or have parts that are made of metal. Metal is made from mineral deposits that are found in rock. The rock is smelted and the metals are filtered through. So it's a very big unit for us here because everything has to do with rocks.